of all the isekais that we've seen, it's pretty unique premise, right? It's like army propaganda, but it's like, you know, the main character is also... Actually, no, there's been a lot of isekai main characters that's a little bit older recently, right? Like Tamura is like a 33-year-old, which I'm assuming is a virgin because this is the isekai and they're always like neats, but they haven't really confirmed it yet. Maybe it's a Giga Chat. I mean, he already kind of is a Giga Chat. Bro, just like as a civilian, right? Since his day off, just goes and fucking kills people. Well, not it's people. It's like monsters that attack from the gate, right? Like, he can do it, man. He's in the military. He's like getting promoted, but he doesn't give a fuck about that. Because he just wants to use his paycheck to buy more figurines and, you know, different, you know, anime merch, right? Because a job is simply a paycheck. Never become a cog in the wheel. Think for yourself and fund your hobbies and make your life more fulfilling. I think there's a very good uh, message that Tamura is telling us. Now, we did cross the gate. Now, we're going to see the goth lolly, the blue hair lolly elf. Let's find Terry reaction. <laughs> I don't know whose voice this is. I'm gonna assume this is blue hair girl because it sounds like soft spoken and she looks like that. Imperial capital. Marquis Castle. Are they talking about what? Well, no, no, no. Where's the military? Are you, okay, they didn't send 60% of the fucking army through the gate, right? Or because like we entered the gate and we killed a bunch of people too, right? Bald. Familiar voice actor. Bald. The Emperor. The Senate? This is almost like Rome, huh? They had the Colosseum and shit. They're so hungry to fight, man. Right? Bald? To pass over all responsibilities. So is this like a... I'm not really completely following, but it looks like he did a little bit of mental gymnastics and he's basically, you know, deferring all the responsibilities. So he's being a bad king right now. And this guy's the only one in the court that's like, Jesus Christ, man. Like, fucking give a shit about your people. So they really did send 60% of their fucking, you know, forces. They, they sent 60% of the forces, and then we killed them all. <laughs> what a bunch of idiots. Dude, we're setting up base. <laughs> nah, this is a fucking boomer meme, but like, you know, StarCraft, you can start setting up your base in front of the enemy territory. We're already like encroaching upon them, huh? Setting up bunkers and shit outside them. What the fuck is wrong with you, bro? Holy shit, bro looks like a fucking witch. Actually, look at his ears. He might be. It's like pointy. Sorcery? It's modern technology. Bald. 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 You're suggesting, okay, they wiped out 60% of your forces. The bald guy is like, don't be a bunch of pussies. Let's go attack them. It's like, we, we, the gate is already captured. What do you think is going to happen if you just roll up? Bald. Silence. I don't wish to sit idly by, so there's no logical reasoning here. Okay? So we gotta go in. Yeah, this kingdom is fucking doomed. Holy shit. This place is absolutely in shambles. Now, a lot of this kingdom seems to resemble, like, ancient Rome, right? Was Rome also like this at a point where all their leadership got cocky and shit and no one gave a fuck? I don't know. It looks like no one is competent here. The king is a fucking idiot. And the only person in this room that's actually, like, trying to give a fuck is the guy on the left, right? The guy that's, like, saying, shit, really? You're just gonna defer all the responsibilities? Goduri no Guaban. Bald. Woo! But like, you idiots, you're all gonna die and get slaughtered. Like, you're a bunch of idiots. We're gonna lose. <laughs> Wait, why is Bro hitting us with the fucking saucy JoJo pose? <laughs> with riz like mine, we don't need to think. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Duran. These are like the allied nations, right? 
CG. Oh god, I'm getting fucking triggered already. Oh my god, this is like PTSD because we just finished. So what? So I'm a spider. So what? <laughs> this is like the CGI army all over again. Oh no. Also bald right there. Paul the sack actually. And there's another baldy over there. But like, holy shit. They straight up, like the empire, the guy, the main guy, the guy from like Rome was like, <laughs> gather everybody, send them in. I don't wish to sit idly by, so we're going in. And he doesn't even show up. Bro was like, do that shit by yourself. No one, he does not give a single fuck. Bullshit, lies. I bet it's a lie. They're all hidden. Bold. They're gonna get slaughtered, man. Oh, they want the credit. No, me the front lines. I'd be like, no, I'm gonna fucking sit in the back line, enjoy getting fucking mowed down by his Gatling guns. But they want the glory of war. That's to make them single handedly, they say. Ah, they're so confident because they don't really know what a gun is yet. And they got the numbers, right? They got 300k, but we have 10k. But it's like a single person could wipe out like 10k. Because I want to live? He's got a good feeling. Intuition. He used to call me, he's called the lion of the Urba clan. He's the only smart one here, huh? All right. Susume, let's go! Woo! Let's march to our fucking death. What are you gonna do to Gatling guns? Ooh. They still haven't shown up? Did the Empire straight up just like bait them? They're like, hey guys, you want the coalition? Let's all ally up together and I promise good rewards. Please, go take him out. He doesn't even show up to the first meeting and he doesn't even send their men. Or I, it's either that or they're all dead, but it's like, there's not a single soldier. I know that we sent 60% of the forces, but still, like, sh should you not try to, like, at least, like, try to help, like, act like you're helping? <laughs> they already go in and die? Oh my god, this is gonna be a fucking crazy battle. Do not enter. <laughs> Fuck your sign. Oh, 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 what's that sound? Did it shoot something? Oh! Artillery! <laughs> what did you expect? What did you expect? They didn't expect anything. And this is, this is a cool thing about this show, right? Because, like, usually in Isakar stuff, in, in, like, anime specifically, guns usually never do shit, right? Bombs usually never do shit, right? So whenever you see, like, actual modern weapons being used in anime, you never really think too much of it because it's like, oh, everyone else has, like, magic powers and shit. But it's like, in this anime, it's a little bit different, you know? Military might. We're just gonna nuke him. Is there no, like, magicians? No magic here? Like, what, what? Damn. Yeah, that's what you get for going to the front lines. You should have read the fucking sign, man. They probably did. You can't even recover their corpses. <laughs> Allied Kingdom's first offensive result. Approximately 10,000 dead within like fucking 10 seconds. That poor dragon, man. Ally <laughs> 40,000 dead now. <laughs> 50k done already. You should retreat. Why? Out of pride? <laughs> night raid. They're trying to be sneaky. Should we, we should probably have like, you know, night goggles, right? We should be ready to fight in the night way better than they can, right? So they're going to probably be all sneaky. Be like, we're going to tiptoe in. <laughs> but we got fucking night vision goggles. Brrr. All right, they go. They go for the ambush, guy. They go for the ambush. Good luck. Good luck. Yeah, shh, guys. Shh. Yeah, you're done. Oh, you're done. These are flares. There's night flares. Yeah. Oh, you should have fucking ran away. You should have retreated, man. Yeah, it's over. It's over. 
he's gonna say, keep going, run, run. And by the time he looks back, everyone's gonna be dead except him. He's gonna be like, what the fuck just happened? Susume, Susume. Oh, barbed wire, ooh. What are they gonna? Okay, 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 hold up. They, they made it through, they made it through, they made it through. Oh, now you say run, now you say run. What the fuck are these shields gonna do, man? There's no point even be armored. It's just fucking dead weight. Brr, brr, brr. This isn't even war. This is like a how the fuck? How the fuck? This guy's luck is insane right now. But this is just like a demonstration of power. Right, right, right. He did say he wanted to get one arrow in for his boys. One at least. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> he went fucking mad at the end. Boom! No, that was self-defense, dude. We were doing defense. We had a sign there. We said, don't cross the sign. And they did. Uh, vultures. They prey on corpse, right? I mean, it's like, they started this shit first, right? They fucking sent 60% of their men to Earth. <laughs> Is there any loot? Probably not. They're all just blown up. You're fighting people from the fucking cave era. They like straight up they're fucking cavemen compared to our technology. What have you done, you idiot? Bald. This guy's so fucking troll. The empire was straight up like, all right, let's go in. Cause I feel like it. Fuck it. Let's just go in. All right, let's get the boys. All right, the boys are going to go in. I'm not even going to help them. And now they're all fucking dead. What are you going to do now, bro? What? Wait, maybe he's not dumb. Wait, wait, wait. Our neighbors can no longer threaten the empire. Cause his, cause he, he did say in the beginning, if it looks like the empire is losing power, then everyone below them is gonna revolt. So like, he decided to intentionally call them. <laughs> you know what? Hold up. My respect for this guy has suddenly skyrocketed. Wait, wait, let him cook. He's actually thinking. Poison their wells. Take their food and livestock. Extremely short-sighted, but like, he, I thought that he wasn't thinking at all. Like he was scheming from the beginning. Scorched Earth Tactics. Fuck the tax revenue, I guess. Recalled within the Senate beginning when Marquis... So it's, I guess it's like a recall as in like bring people down and, and vote. The Senate is like a government body that could like re-elect a new leader or some shit, yeah? Pink hair girl. Finally, from the opening, pink hair girl. Ooh. It's a princess? Yeah, that was daddy's plan. We're gonna poison the wells now and take all the food and the livestock. That's what we're doing. Sure, sure we are. Pinya. He's self-aware. We're too ignorant. The technology is too OP. Bro is actually so smart. What a fucking schemer. Does he? What, I, I wonder how he feels about his own daughter. Is he using this opportunity to also get rid of the daughter? Is the princess a fucking annoyance? Knowing his character so far, it's like, I wouldn't put it above, like, beyond him to be like, yeah, fuck the princess. Ooh. Bald Eagle. America? America! America wants to get involved? Yeah, they need a... What's it called? Democracy, guys. They need freedom. It's oil. We need to send our people there. The Americans are scheming as well, huh? Okay, okay. How are we going to do that? How are we going to get to know the people and the culture of this place? We're gonna meet the goth lolly, the blue hair lolly, and the elf, and the waifus are gonna fucking teach us about this world? When are they gonna show up? The townspeople, will he see like a cat girl there? 
Huh. What, what is this fucking mission gonna be in the future? You, you gotta fucking impregnate this elf girl to maintain diplomacy here? Like what? You, you gotta fucking, you know, wife up these fucking isekai waifus so that, you know, for the sake of Japan and knowing more about the gate for peace, you need to do this? Holy shit, his name is Itami. I just called him Tamura in the beginning. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. I called him Tamura in the intro of this video. Holy shit. It's because we just watched Tensura. Oh my god. I called him Tamura in the beginning. Oh shit, the people in the intro are gonna be like, Who the fuck is Tamura? You don't care about this anime? Sir Gregor, please make this look good. Sir Gregor, please go back to the intro and, and, and please please explain what's going on to the audience, okay? Oh, God. No, I did this intentionally. I, 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 I did this intentionally because if people get mad and comment, it boosts the engagement. All part of the plan. I always knew it was Itami, okay? I didn't know. I did not know. <laughs> Oh, there's so many names, I'm not gonna bother remembering them. I will remember Sergeant First Class, Kuribayashi though. Okay, I, I do see Kuribayashi. Mm, Itami, not Tamuro, Itami. Yeah, Itami, yep, yep. He just continues to fail upwards, huh? But we're second lieutenant, she's first sergeant. I need a fucking spreadsheet, man. The fuck? Why is that here? Those uh, stone pillar architect stuff, isn't that like in, on Earth too? Isn't that like famous? What, what the fuck is it doing here? I don't know what the exact terminology is for those stone things. Okay, Koda Village. Ooh, waifu. Y'all want some freedom? Some democracy? Liberation. Guns. Oil. Bald. Dragons were around. Yeah, this is the guy that wanted- he's a furry. He wants- Milf Sorceress, yes please. Does he have a fetish for s Magical girls. The elf didn't really look like a magical girl. And the dark- the, the, the goth lolly doesn't really look like a magical girl either. But the blue haired girl with the staff... She kinda? Maybe? Could be a magical girl? Kind of? He's got more magical girl merch than Utena does. Cootie Bai, she probably thinks that her leaders are fucking idiots. Creepy fucks. All our weapons old issue? We broke? Disposable weapons. Who is gonna be a Koda village? The elf? Blue haired girl? Goth lolly? Wow. How kind and thoughtful. We're the defense force. The people love us. Army is great, guys. No propaganda here. We're here to make friends. We're peacekeeping. We're peacekeeping, guys. Oh, Isekai language? Perfect time for more propaganda. Let's uh, put out the fire. And they're gonna be like, wow, our heroes. It's a dragon. Y'all wish for a dragon. Here it is. Uh, Godzilla, Godzilla reference. Kuribayashi! Go solo the fucking dragon. Have you ever, have you ever played uh, Modern Warfare 2? There's a character named Ramirez, and you're playing as Ramirez as the main character. And the meme is, Ramirez has to fucking do everything. Save the world with a fucking single knife. So Kuribayashi, take out the dragon right now by herself. Did you just... Did, 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 did he just rizz her up there? I'm too scared to go alone. You wanna come with me? You tell me Riz? <laughs> I mean, the dragons went down pretty easily before with the Gatling guns and shit, so... For no reason. There's a valid reason? Nah, man. It was not a wyvern, dude. Actually, I don't know. I didn't even look at it. Oh, 
Go help the settlers. Elf girl? Blue haired girl? Oh my god. Look at that hand, dude. It's all burnt up. Holy shit. Wow. Give him a little prayer there, too. How respectful. No one survived? Where's the other missing ones? A hundred people died. That's terrible. As we just, you know, casually slaughtered 60,000 people. Yes, they were enemies. Yes, they were encroaching our territory. Yes, I understand. I understand that, right? They were starting shit and we're doing self-defense. But like, you know, the, 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 the weight of life, the value of life, right? 100 people, 60,000, and, and don't, and don't even think about the 60,000, okay? Think about the 60% of the forces from the Empire that went into the gate in episode 1, right? Think about that too. The soundtrack right now is really good. But I'm just saying the value of life when you have to ignore, you know, the intent, it's like... Wouldn't people like, you know, isn't that the most cliche thing too is like, is there like an explosion or something or like fire? You like jump down a well, right? To avoid it. Elf! Ah, elf waifu is the first one. Elf. Elf. All right. That's an episode of Gate. That went by so fucking fast. And yes, it's Itami, not Tamuro. Yes, I understand that. So I think um, I, I love the world building of uh, this empire. Like, like, even though I know nothing about them, I, I do love the politics here involved. Like, the king immediately, I thought he was just like an ignorant douchebag that didn't give a fuck about anything and was just playing around. But this dude was a schemer from all along. This Jojo pose? This fucking Jojo pose, dude? He was like, nah, I'm intentionally setting a fire, bro. All these other people that's gonna come for us when they realize that we're losing power? Let's call them out first. Fuck them. And then let's poison their wells and take all their food. This dude is fucking insane. I actually have a lot of respect for the king. Listen, like, he's a dick. I understand that. But, like, he, he, it's way better than what I was expecting, right? Everyone else here, they're like... <laughs> Let's go to the front lines! Let's go to the front lines! Immediately we ignore the sign, get blown up 10k dead. And then it's like, oh, let's do an ambush, guys. It's like, shh, let's tiptoe. Surely they're not gonna know. Surely they don't have night vision or different radars. Nope. Immediately hit them with the flare and fucking artillery shots. I think the beautiful thing about this enemy, again, like I said before, is how modern weapons are like respected in this anime, right? Because modern weapons in usual anime, they don't do anything. Guns like bullets like they usually don't do anything in anime but in this anime it's fucking raw it's pretty realistic in how you know guns can just fucking kill you a dragon fucking shoot it down right so that's pretty cool there is some stuff with the american side too back on earth but like in, in terms of the world building and the politics of this like the teikoku and the, the empire and like the other stuff i'm enjoying this a lot itami finally gets his first waifu though it's not the goth lolly that everyone's hyped about but it is the elf let's see if he has an elf fetish just like grimuru but hey if you're still here if you did enjoy this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for more content and until next time take care